At the source of all life, there is water. On Mars, where it is rare, water is a source of conflict, struggle, and death. Since the turmoil, there have been unending wars, fought over the possession of clean water. We are the forgotten children of Earth, trapped in this red, barren wasteland. Here, hell is not a concept, it's our reality. And the reality is that every drop counts. Then there were the unfortunates, caught in the full power of the sun's radiation, forced to deform, mutate into unrecognizable monsters. The others, the ones who remained similar to our ancestors in likeness, hid under massive metal shells governed by water corporations. But in the slums, people's lives aren't worth much more than the mutants. And I would know. That's where I spent the first 10 years of my life, under the boot of the Vori. Of course, in despair, there is hope. Some have begun to explore, travel even, from corporation to corporation, leaving their loyalties behind. We have organization, structure, and inevitably, politics. We have rulers, a people's assembly, and far removed from us, the Dowser, the inaccessible face of abundance. And finally, there's us, the elite protectors of the people, the spearhead of the army, my brothers and sisters who all share the same special gift. We are Technomancers. Ahoy, Zachariah. Scott, you came. Wouldn't miss it for the world. Sure, my memory isn't what it is, but I remember to write things down on my calendar. Though I do sometimes forget where my calendar is. Anyhow, I knew your last cadet mission was today. Any nerves? If it's any consolation, you look more than fit enough. No, I'm good. I'm ready. Mmm. -hmm. Yes, healthy flush of the skin. Movement. You don't look stressed out. Very well, I won't bother you anymore. Oh, but if I can bother you, just a moment. I recently acquired a batch of materials that can improve your gear. It's not much, but I thought you'd like it. It can't still 
Still can't believe you're going to be an officer soon. Yeah, me too. Thanks, Scott. It means a lot. Ah. I fear we've dilly-dallied on pleasantries. Your master, Sean, waits for you in the courtyard. So stiff, that one. I fear his spine is concocted from steel. A spine prosthetic. How interesting. What if... Oh, and stop by the clinic and come shoot the chit-chat. No, no, that's not... Just don't be a stranger. If you feel ill or need a hand, come see me. I'm always glad to help. Good luck, my boy. Thank you, Scott. Will do. I promise. Fucking mansers. Every time they come around, something new is broken. <laughs> Zachariah, today, as you know, marks your final mission as a cadet. I trust you are prepared. Of course, Master. Ready, willing, and able. And a little nervous. Normal and expected. That's why I have gathered together your usual instructors to allow you to warm up and prepare. It's for you to ace the tests for each fighting technique. Prepare yourself. And once you are ready, join me at the station. From there, a train will take us to the mission site. Thank you, Master. If you would like to practice your technomancy techniques or care to do some staff training, I have time. That little brush up on my technique could never hurt. Indeed. Remember to attend to your surcharge risk. I would hate to have an accident.
Would you care to fight again? I'm always honored to learn what you have to teach. Excellent. I'd advise you to not try anything. Would you care to fight again? I would love to. Another time, Master. Thank you. Of course. Keep in mind, a well-trained staff can be quite formidable. And as you know, the control over our technomancy is what makes us unique. How about a little self-defense training? Sure, why not? That's your spirit. Here we go. Care to go again? Maybe later. Your call. You're gonna wish you had some good defensive training, though, when you find yourself in trouble. Wanna test your skills with a knife and a gun? It's not really in the rule book, so if you do, you need to be discreet. Let's do it. All right. Advise you to not try and go again. Another time. Don't underestimate stealth techniques, or how much faster you can be in combat with light weapons. Soldier, please. Hey, heard from Captain Sean you're heading out to the station. You leaving now? Yep, already ready. Stop right there. We're conducting a search. Look at this piece of shit. Well, well, what do we have here? Huh? Road trash seems lost, don't it? You forget we don't want your kind around here, Trash. Move your sorry ass out of here before you find yourself bleeding from both of them. I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't ask you to speak. Did I? You useless piece of shit. Why would I want to hear what you have to say? Waste of space. Please, please. I just. Uh. Mouth and just fucking die! The corpse will feed the rats. At least then you'd have a purpose. Such a waste of life. A waste of space. Am I right? A rogue is a rogue is a Zack, right? You can dress him up, but. Fuck off, Alan. Before I. Zachariah, we're leaving. Certain people are graduating to the rank of officer today. 
while others aren't even worth the expense of their time or energy. Let us be off to more remarkable things. <laughs>